WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading down off 532. Nasdaq's off 332. S&Ps are up uh, off 74. You get some uh, heavy damage out here in the marketplace, folks. That's a downdraft of the Nasdaq of 2.5%, 2.1 on the S&Ps, and 1.5 in the Dow Industrials. Gold. Gold contract up $2.60, trading at 18 98 an ounce. You get silver down 19 cents, $23.48 an ounce. Light sweet crude. That's trading up uh, three bucks, 107.57. Notes and bonds. You get the 10 year note right now, trading up 13 ticks at 120.01. The 30 year up 29 at 142.14. And King Dollar just doesn't stop. Up 548, trading 102.300. Now, the high in King Dollar, folks, is 102.979. I expect that's going to get hit. Euro is out here. Uh, 127.56, you got the yen, um, no, the euro's, I'm sorry, what, the euro is 106, the yen's 127.56, and the British pound is at 125 to 1 US dollar. We get over and take a look at the S&P, bottom lines, you're going to have heavy volume once again on the way down, you know, we'll see whether it can hold, man, that's the bottom line, um, you know, my take is that it's not going to hold, my take is that 410 is game, right now you're at 420 in the S&P, NDX 100, that is going to have some big movement after the close today, the cool thing in the NDX 100, you have Microsoft and Google coming out with numbers. Now, they both come out with numbers, folks, as soon as the, o, the close is over. So the futures are going to be still open. There's going to be big action out here. The Qs, they're down 830 right now. Bottom line, you have a high volume low at 318. That's going to get hit. And the real question is going to be is that how does Google versus Microsoft handle this market? Meaning, once they're going to come out with the numbers, what's the market going to do about it? Notes and bonds. We take a look at the note and bond market. Inside the note and bond market, folks, you get a counter trend bounce. About time. Uh, bottom line, you're going up. And if you just want to see this, it's 1.3 million contracts that we have right now inside the 10-year. And guess what? That's not enough, man. That's not even close. You're going down on, you know, 2, 1.7, 1. Yeah, 1.7. 1 1.3 in the way up. You get a counter trend bounce happening. Right now, the 10 year is yielding uh, 2.7. And just so you can imagine, if you could fast forward, uh, fast reverse this back three months, could you imagine that you get you had a Dow that's down 1,000 points, the next day it's down 500 points, and the 10 year only goes up a point and a half. I mean, forget it, man. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. <laughs>